Hi Capricorn, Sistiana here to do your monthly reading for September 2019. This is for all Capricorns, Sun, Moon, and Rising. So if you don't know your Moon and Rising sign, check the link in the description. I'm not affiliated with the website, but I want you about to get the most out of these readings. So you need to find out your Moon and Rising sign. And if you still can't figure it out, feel free to contact me privately. My information is in the description below on how to do so. And you can also find the links to these tarot decks that I use, the, the Gilded Tarot and the Essentials Tarot. That is my affiliate links for Amazon. So, please remember to like, share, and subscribe, and hit the bell icon when you subscribe so that you could be notified when I upload new content. And I think that's it. Wow. Okay, Capricorn. What does Capricorn need to know for this month of September 2019? What does Capricorn need to know for the month of September? Okay. Oh, feeling stuck, feeling a bit like you, you, you don't know which one to do, you not sure which way to go, almost a paralyzed kind of feeling. So, and we have the Six of Cups. So, something from your past coming back and creating that feeling of like you don't know which way to go. And the Eight of Swords, you have really some stuck energy here. Capricorn, what's going on? Possibly dealing with a Libra with the Justice card here. And the Ace of Swords, you have a brand new beginning from a blast from the past. Something from your past coming back, giving you a new beginning. And the Hermit, this is for the sign of Virgo. Or it's possibly just coming out to say that, you know what, everything's going to happen in this month in the Virgo season. Could be just a clarifying um, clarifying of the timing, I feel. Okay. But we'll see how it goes. Also, could just it could mean for some of you that you need to go within for inner knowledge. You know, you know what you need to do. So you shouldn't feel stuck you shouldn't feel paralyzed but this person coming back from the past or the situation coming back from the past has you all tied up in knots but you have a new beginning coming from it and you got the four of pentacles four of pentacles is like saying to not hold things too closely don't get out of this energy of being stuck because it's affecting you it's affecting your foundation. It's affecting your home. And then you have the Queen of Wands, which is an air, um, a fire energy person, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or it's a woman that is very control, a, a person that's very control. And you could be Cap Capricorn. You could be this person. You know, you could be ending off your month feeling in control of everything. And then underlying energy is the Three of Cups. So there could be a third party situation coming into play here with all of this here does give me that indication that there is a third person coming in. You know the whole saying, two's a crowd, three's, um, uh, I mean, two's, two's company, three's a crowd, sorry. So while you've been happy, somebody from the past is coming back and making you feel really really stuck in your situation like you don't know what to do you you can't make a decision you can't make up your mind so let's get some clarifiers and see where this goes at capricorn and clarify the underlying energy for capricorn for the month of september 2019 clarify the energy for september 2019 uh oh okay I don't normally take two. Y'all know if y'all been watching my readings, I don't normally take two, but I feel like this is right. It's having to make a decision, not being able to make a decision, and you have a new beginning, the Ace of Cups, 
a new beginning with the fool. The fool comes in as an, an ending with a new beginning. The Ace of Cups is that beautiful, beautiful, emotional new beginning. It's new energy for you. So this Two of Swords is really not being able to make a decision on who you want to be with, I feel. And that's not going to be for all you Capricorns, but that's what I'm feeling for this right now, okay? So let's get the rest of your cards and we'll see where this goes. Six of Cups with the Ace of Rods. I'm, I'm telling you, this is a new beginning with somebody from your past, Capricorn. Eight of Swords with the All Believers. So something's being revealed that has you feeling stuck and cornered. Justice with the Two of Cups. So balance, possibly dealing with the Libra. But Libra is all about balance as well. And this is within a relationship, okay? With the Two of Cups. Ace of Swords. The Knight of Rods. Chaotic activity and energy coming in with this new beginning. Okay? It's going to have you feeling like it, you can't, you don't know which way to go. Like you're running around with your head cut off. Okay? Hermit. With the Three of Rods. So you're going to make a decision and you're going to turn your back on a situation. And it's going to be from you going within and you know what you need to do, Capricorn. You already know what you need to do. I, I, I don't know what you're doing here because obviously you know what you need to do and you, you don't need me to tell you. But maybe you do. Maybe you need. Maybe you're needing this validation. Maybe you're needing this little bit of a nudge forward to make that decision. The Four of Pentacles with the Eight of Pentacles. So you're putting it. You're going to be putting in a lot of work into your home, into your foundation, and don't don't hold it all in. Okay, you need to spend in order to receive. So remember the law of attraction here. What you put out, you shall receive, okay? Queen of Wands with the Ten of Cups. So you are definitely going to have your happy ending towards the end of the month, this month, Capricorn. It's going to be a happy home life for you. You've got to decide which one of these people you want to have in your life. Uh, heartbreak, three of, three of Swords. This is definitely a third-party situation. I, I cannot stress that more, Capricorn. And the cards, they, this is the way that they came out. This is the way that I'm reading them. If it doesn't make sense to you, check your moon and rising. Um, leave me a comment below. Uh, I, I want to hear your thoughts. And if you can, at least. The third party situation, y'all. Somebody from your past is coming back or a situation from your past is coming back to create a new beginning. And it is shaking up your world, Capricorn. Wow. Things are getting shook up. You're about to have a very interesting month, to say the least. So, I wish you a wonderful month and all the best of luck. So, until next time, I'm out for now.